Currently trying to come up with new intros. So all I'll say is, another product review. Clean Korea Premium Bubble Towels. But first, I'll put the kettle on. Welcome back to Hotchkiss Performance. Why did I pick such a long name for a company? Anyway, and one that's hard to say. Clean Create Premium Bubble Towels. These are £8.95 and you get two. One cream coloured towel and one blue coloured towel. So you could designate, say, one for cleaning and one for dressing. These are designed for delicate surfaces um, such as leather or piano black trim uh, that can easily get scratched um, you know with a quite a if you have sort of a aggressive microfiber or even just a you think that's soft um, these sort of surfaces mark so easily um, that you do want something really delicate especially if you're working on premium you know high-end cars um, that you know you want to take care of you don't want to be scratching anything in those because they can be costly to replace so if we have a look i haven't even opened this yet uh starting this review obviously by the end of it i will have used it but i just wanted to show you what it comes like in the packet and brand new fresh out of the box so here we go so fresh out of the packet i can definitely feel how soft and premium these are now they would be delicate um, on surfaces it's pretty pretty soft i must say real time this I'm, i haven't ever you know touched these or had them out of the packet just wanted to show you from the beginning really soft now obviously i will cut to using this in just a second because i don't want to do a review without having using it First impressions though, spot on. Um, it's quite expensive, I must say. But that was before I've actually got it out of the packet. Now I can see where the price comes from. Uh, I wanted to try these for a while because I do find that, you know, to get a designated cloth for your leather uh, cleaning can be difficult because some can be too aggressive and others kind of don't absorb any liquid. So if you're using say a leather cleaning brush which is not to hand typical you know and you're using a foam cleaner or even just a liquid cleaner um, as an example and you're scrubbing it and it's creating a lather and then you have to wipe the excess residue off some cloths don't really absorb um, the product into them and just kind of push them around I'm sure it will be interesting to try these, but first impressions are really good. I can tell that they're really soft and really premium. Um, obviously, it is almost around £4 per cloth, but uh, we'll give them a trial run, and we'll cut back in just a second. Now, they can be used to absorb product, as well as kind of just a quick spray and wipe, whether you spray it onto the cloth itself or onto the surface, depending on how you do it. Um, I like that it is cream. A lot of people tend to shy away from light coloured cloths um, because it looks really grubby and dirty after a while and you kind of want to keep your cloths nice. Well, that's a good indication. Same with drying towels. I prefer to have a towel where you can see the dirt because then you know when it needs to be washed. Um, if this was black or grey, for example, you wouldn't be able to really see the, the dirt that you're picking up. So it's a good indication of how dirty your car is because um, it might look clean, but go over with a clean, brightly coloured cloth and you might find that you pick up dirt that you didn't think was even there. So colours, even the blue one, um, is light enough and bright enough to be able to see uh, any sort of residue and dirt that you're going to be picking up. So there we are. That's... Uh, that until we get into using it which i'm looking forward to stay tuned okay so initial test results i would say a success uh, i don't know if you can see on the camera uh, but it has picked up 
a fair amount of dirt off the steering wheel. Now, I do keep on top of that. Um, I do clean it down on every maintenance wash, but even so, it still picked up some, some dirt on the cloth. Now, I'm not saying that other cloths wouldn't pick that amount of dirt off, uh, because in that sense, you're probably thinking, well, just a standard um, Kirkland Mike Fab, which everyone seems to rave about, will do the same job. I'm not saying it won't, but the thing is with this for me, is peace of mind, that you're not going to harm or scratch the leather or any delicate surfaces such as piano black trim, because I can guarantee you that using a Kirkland Mike fiber cloth on piano black trim inside a car is going to mark it and scratch it and mar it over time. Mine not on the first time, but you keep going away on that surface. They're not, I've got one here. Good old Kirkland. They're not the softest cloth on the planet. Even the plush side. Um, yeah, they're not bad, but I have known these scratch delicate surfaces, you know, soft paints and also interiors of cars. Um, I know people rave on these and the cheap, the, you know, readily available, easily accessible. But we're talking about the finer, the finer details here. Um, it's difficult to test because I don't have my Lamborghini with me at the moment. Uh, I will have to drive over to, uh, can't keep straight face with that one. Drive over to, I've got where it is, I've got that many. <laughs> anyway. It is difficult because if I did have a Lamborghini here, I could test it against that on, you know, delicate leather surfaces and interior trim panels. But, so there's mixed reactions, basically. I know I'm going to get mixed reactions on this. Um, again, as always, you know, I put my money into these products because I think about return on investment. I do like premium products. I like premium uh, tools and equipment. So maybe you could say I'm biased, but I'm trying my best not to be here, trying to be as unbiased as possible and looking at it from all angles. Um, and like I said, initial thoughts are that the cloths do what they're meant to do. Um, very soft, very delicate, very premium, I would say. So would I recommend one? That's difficult, must admit. You know, I'm not going to be one of those YouTubers that just says everything's absolutely amazing uh, and you should go and buy it because I'm not all about that. You know, th these items are expensive. I would buy these again, though, when these become knackered. Um, like I say, going back to the peace of mind that you can just go hell for leather with these because you don't want to be messing about trying to be too delicate when you know that you can just wade in with these full force clean the surface down and get the job done and you're not going to be worrying about it scratching marking or anything like that so the peace of mind aspect to me is why these are worth it and i would recommend them some of you will agree and some of you will disagree those are my thoughts might seem like a basic cloth and a basic product to talk about, but I've got mixed feelings about this, I must say. Um, but I'm just being honest with you as always. And that is pretty much it for the Clean Career bubble towels. And that wraps it up. So please let me know in the comments if you have used, you know what's coming because I say at the end of every video, um, if you have used these cloth, what you do think to them. Uh, if you haven't, are you thinking of purchasing them now? Or even after this review, you're thinking, yeah, I'll give them a try. Um, I wanted to do this because there's so many products from the clean range that I've looked at and thought, it is. it seems expensive on the surface. Now, after testing a few of the products now, um, 
and we will be testing many, many more. I can see that it is growing and they're always developing, they're always improving. Uh, you know, I go and see Nick at XL Detailing Supplies quite often and, you know, just from speaking to him and what he tells me about the products, um, they are growing and I feel like it is quite a premium brand. Uh, it will become one, definitely, if people aren't kind of jumping onto them straight away. I think every product that I have tried has been really spot on and really shows the difference compared to other brands that you know you might think cleaners just sort of copying off others or they get them done in the same factory now i'm not stupid i know that a lot of these products come from the same place you know all that rebottled stuff which doesn't really bother me if the product works i don't care where it's made to be honest um could be stitched together by mermaid's hair who knows um but there we are so just keep looking out for clean and i do want to uh you know, keep reviewing these products because I feel like they deserve the credit. So please let me know your thoughts. I shall see you. And I'm sorry I wave my hand all the time when I'm speaking. I need to stop that. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. What's up everybody? In this video, what's up everybody? In this video, we're doing a review in a new intro. So today, review, Clean Career Premium Bubble Towel. I need a new intro. How would you approach someone? What's up everybody? Currently thinking of new intros. So all I'll say is, Clean Career Review. No, start that again. Hi, hello. You just say Hello. Need I dumb. All right, mate. How are you? I need a new intro, people. Have you got any suggestions? Let me know. What's up, everybody? In this video, we're going to be doing a new one. A bit dreary, this is dribble. Clean premium bubble towels. Review of this video. Today, another product we do, Clean Create Premium Bubble Towel. Welcome back to Why is my name so hard to say? Um, 